In today's video, I'll show you how to take this square photo and turn it into this circular photo using masking in Video Leap. I will be using the free version. I'll tap the plus sign to open a Video Leap project. Don't worry about this notification, you won't see it. I'm going to tap on stock. And then I'll type notification bell in the search bar. You'll probably want to use some free images. When you tap on search, you'll want to make sure Pixabay is selected. Tap on Pixabay to select it. You'll notice we've got three videos here. I like the one in the middle, so I'm going to tap on it to add it to the Video Leap project. This is what we've got so far. Let's add our channel icon. Tap Mixer from the main toolbar. Tap on Recents and choose the photo. Notice that it's square. Split your overlay by tapping on the split icon when it appears. Remove the extra footage. Tap the balloon thumbnail to expand the overlay and make sure the end of your photo lines up with the end of the graphic you're using. Otherwise, your channel icon picture will disappear off the screen before the graphic ends. This may take some time. If you need to, use the split icon to remove unwanted sections of either clip, like this. Then, once you have the clip adjusted, just slide the end of the overlay back to the playhead like this. To change the shape of your photo and turn it into your channel icon, tap on mask and choose radial. This will make the photo circular. Then go back to the main timeline using the left hand facing arrow and you'll get the square with a circle inside it. You can pinch and zoom to resize your photo so that it fits inside the circle like this. Long press and drag it to move it where you need it and pinch and zoom to resize it and then move it back into position. One of the limitations of the free version of Video Leap is that you can only have up to two video layers before you have to upgrade to a pro version. To export this video, I'll tap on export, choose a resolution, 1080p, using the slider, and then tap on save. This will save the video clip to my camera roll. 